we are going to some massive event in Montreal called La Grande Récompense, which is French for the big or the great reward. Apparently there's gonna be 4,200 kids celebrating festivities in Montreal's Olympic Stadium, and we're sleeping over in the Olympic Stadium on the field. There's gonna be 4,000 kids having a sleepover overnighter on the field of the Olympic Stadium. To a kid, this is a dream. Mila, you excited? Okay, no, it's like it's like someone's house that fits a baseball field. It's gonna be crazy, and I know objectively from a kid's perspective, it's amazing to sleep under the dome of the Olympic Stadium. To a neurotic adult, I'm a little apprehensive. I'm a sensitive sleeper. I sleep with earplugs. I have my routine, and the older I get, the more I like it, and don't like it being disrupted. Too bad! So that's what we're doing. Um, Definitely here. All right, this really isn't so much for the video as it is just to remember where we parked. P166. We are definitely at the entrance. You excited? A little nervous? She's nervous. Uh, okay, hey, bonjour. Bonjour. C'est pour m'enregistrer. Going past security. Let's see if the man with the rubber glove is going to be surprisingly gentle. Oh, this is the Olympic Stadium. Look at this. Small group because you'll have about 4,000 friends in there. Okay? Yeah, it's at the uh, 515. We have never seen the Olympic Stadium like this, obviously. So many kids, kids everywhere. Look. This is a little more than I was expecting. Le Grand Défi. Right now the announcer is telling everybody how to activate their lightning swords or these things. by Nestle. Oh, here, you want to do this? Yeah! <laughs> I am the best! It's an overnighter, it's crazy. Back to the set. My goodness, that's hot. So, are uh, you a vlogger too? What's that? You a vlogger also? No, I'm not a vlogger, I don't film myself. <laughs> Apparently there's a trampoline show and the highest trampoline is like 27 meters above the ground. What are you guys looking at? <laughs> okay, so the show is starting. I'm not going to record the whole thing. I'm just going to try to capture some of the best moments.
tallest. I don't think he's at the tallest yet. Okay, so they're, they're gonna jump from the they're top. They're gonna jump from that top there, which is 25 meters high. It's a little ridiculous. It's very dangerous. I can do that. They were kicking the surface of the water to make it bubblier so when she hits it, it was softer than if it was... Okay, right now we're off to like another section where there's apparently a huge 2,000 square feet of bouncy balloons or inflatable castle thingies. going to get some food. I think I have tinnitus. Ringing in the ears from excessive noise. Ooh, we have our own picnic table up here. Apparently I can go behind the scenes here, which is the entire Nestle team who sponsored this event. Look at this view, actually. This is amazing. This is not a view that most people ever get at the Olympic Stadium. This is like... I think the stadium's capacity is 23 or 27,000. Empty on the bottom except for the 4,000 students that are going to sleep here overnight. By the way, we've made the decision to go home tonight. 4,000 kids are going to sleep on the ground there. This is the Olympic Stadium, the beautiful roof that never actually opened. Look it up. Wikipedia, the Olympic Stadium, for anyone who's not from Quebec or Canada and doesn't know the history of this building. It's amazing. And by amazing, I mean somewhat catastrophic. But Look it up, it's fantastic. I knew, I knew she looked familiar. I spotted the diver here coming to get in here. Um, <laughs> the diver coming up the stairs. I had one question for you. Yeah. They were kicking the water as you jumped. Were they making it foamy so that it's a softer landing? Uh, no, it do not change anything about, the landing is not soft at all from that height, but it really helped me to see where is the landing. Oh. Because from up, I couldn't really uh, see the difference between the top and the bottom of the pool. So the fact that they are moving, make the water move and I see well where I have to land. Okay, that's very cool. Yeah. I, I thought maybe by bubbling the water it made it like a softer entry. Uh, I wish, but no. <laughs> and does it, does it hurt? Uh, it's really solid when we enter into the water. We have to be really, really strong for that second. Then after change our trajectory to be sure to do not go directly to the, to the, to the bottom. Yeah. And how deep was the pool? I, it's a, a, an outside pool, so only the height that you see, it's the height that really? you have. Really? Have you ever really badly injured yourself? Actually, I did, but in circus, not in high diving. Uh -huh. High diving, uh, I didn't. It goes pretty <laughs> We've well. We've got a gauntlet of kids running behind. Yay, yeah, salut! <laughs> Have you ever done like a butt flop or a belly flop or anything of an imperfect landing from that height? Not from that height, but from 10 meters, I do it several times. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but when I go up, I'm sure it's going to be really good. If no, I don't go up. That's amazing. Yeah. Okay. Thank, <laughs> Thank you very you. much. It was fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>
hope explosion experiment. L'important c'est que lorsqu'il la corde, les bonbons vont tomber et on va avoir une excellente réaction chimique. Ça c'est mon père, hein? ça c'est mon père, pas de surprise. Hein? Faut tirer droit dans 5, tout le monde ensemble. 4, 3, 2, 1, on tire. We have to wash that back in slow mo. That's cool. Had a good time. So we're going home because the chances of me being able to sleep there overnight were less than nil. The chances were so much below zero that the chances were actually sub-zero. We got the entire festival, the amazing shows, that science experiment was fantastic. Now we're gonna go home, have a bath, walk the dogs, have dinner. You're gonna be asleep by the time we get home. I'm gonna carry you to bed. Do I know how to get out of here? And tomorrow we go to La Ronde. So stay tuned for that. Peace out.